And then the lightning round is over. Are you ready? Ski dead over the lightning round. Christmas. Hey, let's go to Roy in Pennsylvania. Roy. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Jim. Go Phils. I lo- love you know, Phils. Years on me, I, too, was a Penn Manor elementary kid. Get and out. I grew up on Preston Road. I grew up no, on No, come Road. on. Were you there the day I was suspended or falsely? No, I'm sorry. What the? <laughs> were, you, what? were you a Cromwell yeah. or Stokes Road kid? Preston Road. Man, I've met him on Preston. Well, what stock we got? Okay. MLI, Muller Industries. Oh, yeah, I, heard- I remember when Muller came out of the De- De- bankrupt steel company. It is a fantastic company. Never gets its due. Very plain vanilla copper products. Buy. Of course, a guy from Preston Road has four cents. At Penn Manor, I used to throw pencils into the roof and they would stick. And then I'd blame it on Doug. Okay, let's go to Trey in Texas. Trey. Jim, I have to toss on my oven mitts these days before opening my brokerage app due to my shares of GoDaddy. They are burning hot, baby. Send me some asbestos. You're absolutely right. That thing is just, that thing is a juggernaut. And one of the reasons is because it's very low mobile and it helps a lot of small businesses. I like it. Let's go to Lou in Pennsylvania. Lou. Hi there. Booyah to you, Curly. In the old days, perhaps. But go ahead. I had red hair, by the way, when I was younger. (laughs) Can you believe it? Red hair. What was that all about? Go ahead. Why don't, you, why don't you grow it again? Um, all right, let me let me uh, talk to who I, I don't even know who to talk to anymore. But go ahead. <laughs> With a lot of conflict from all over the world, from Ukraine to the Middle East, uh, what do you think about this best of breed company called Lockheed Martin? I think you buy Lockheed. I feel badly that I didn't buy it for the uh, for the Chapel Trust because I like Takelet so much. I think you got a winner there. Hey, let's go to Jay in Connecticut. Jay. Jim, big booty I see you from Westport. Oh, from Westport? Oh, I had a summer house in Westport once. It was so much fun. I loved it. There was like this free beach that I used to go to. It's like Sherman something. I don't know. It wasn't bad. What's happening? Sure, uh, at Sherwood Park. And that was it. Compo, Compo Beach. Yeah. I did Compo yeah. too, but I, sans beer, which is like, that's French. Okay. So what else? <laughs> I've been a big follower of yours since. The days at the street.com. You and I have to have a mutual, uh, a mutual acquaintance. But uh, I'm, I'm not going to name drop. What, you got a busy schedule. You got a lot of people calling in. Here's the question: The old computer. You became very constructive when the. I have to be was- down here. It is too low. I, betting against Michael Dell has never been like a really good idea. Okay. I just find that betting against Michael Dell is just going to be a loser. You should be buying the stock. I need to go to Nick in Missouri. Nick. Hey, Jim, it's Nick Peterson calling in from Kansas City, home of the great barbecue. Uh, I, I, want to for, I forgot that. That's true. Arthur's. Do you think Arthur's is overplayed? Leslie Picker said don't use Arthur's. Go to another place. Oh, Maybe Arthur's too much of Arthur Bryant. Okay, that. there we go. All right, so what do you got for me? Okay. I gave you That's Arthur's. Great. What do you got for me? Yeah, so uh, just want to hear your thoughts on qualities. I think uh, they've got great strategic partnerships with uh, Max. Yeah, th- this thing is bothering me. It keeps going lower, and yet other companies in the same industry, vulnerability management, are doing well. Let's find out. It does. It, 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 there's something wrong here with qualities. I am going to have to help with my research team and figure out what to do. Let's go to Ronald in California. Ronald. Hey, Jim. How are your family doing? My family's okay. Thank you for asking. We're trying to figure out what to do this week. Maybe a little garden, maybe a party, you know, that kind of thing. How about you? Well, I have first time grandfather recently, so things are great. Lucky dog. You're just in, a lucky fact, person. Just, Good for you. I just opened up and put a chunk of money in the stock 29 for money I made from your advice. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Attend the meeting tomorrow. So anyway, <laughs> so anyway uh, the company I'm interested in uh, is a smaller version of United Rentals. It has missed the last two quarters, but had a long string of making estimates. It only sells at a 10 PE, and it sports a 2.5% dividend. The company is H&E Equipment. I like that mini. That's a, you know, look, it, 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 it's a mini you and I. You're absolutely right. And I think there's room for it, and I would be a buyer of it. How about Brad in North Carolina? Brad. Booyah, Jim. Booyah. Hey, thank you so much for taking my call, Jim. 
I'm getting older. I'm starting to think a lot about dividends, and I've been really liking Gala BDC. I didn't know if you could share any. No, with. it's okay. You see, I don't really know what they own. It's one of those middle market uh, plays that I get asked a lot about, and they have, and I've told people to avoid them for as long as this show's been on, and I've been very right, so I'm not going to deviate. Let's go to Jonathan in my old home state of Pennsylvania. Jonathan. We are Jim. How is my favorite investing club fellow Buckmont, Pennsylvania native doing? Oh, my. We got a lot of suburban one people here, and I can't believe it. I mean, why doesn't Ed Breen call in? I think I'd be Council Rock when I was there. What's up? I'm a Council Rock alum. Um, my good man, this morning to the club, you gave a great example of how bad reporting in the news impacted a well-known equity recently. I'm struggling to figure out the automobile industry dynamics, and would love your take on the reportage there and what you would be looking for in the stock of Borg Warner. Thank you, Chief. Okay, and thank you for mentioning that I decided to take, a, take on someone. You're never supposed to take on the press, but I've had it. Uh, Borg Warner, just, look, auto business is bad, okay? It's, they need a Fed rate cut, and then it'll go up, but not until then. I am sorry. And that, ladies and gentlemen, the conclusion of the Lightning Round. The Lightning Round is sponsored by Charles Schwab. Coming up, election time means plenty of noise, but Kramer zeroes in on the signal next. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on X. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Mentions. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.